What's up? Welcome back. Uh, obviously, I know you were scheduled to fight in August and uh, had to withdraw from that. I guess, uh, how difficult was it for you to, to make the decision to not compete? Not difficult. I want to fight and uh, I just want to be active and that's why I, I work uh, hard, recovery. Recovery was not easy and I'm, I'm glad to be here and I'm excited. Nice. I know you were waiting to get an opponent, it seemed like, forever. Were you hoping to fight sooner than now? Were you ready to fight or was this the earliest you could fight? This fight? Yeah. Um, I was asking to fight. I beginning ask uh, fight November, December. I beginning to ask, tell them, yeah, I will ready like February, March, before Ramadan, I want to fight, and it was it was not surprised me, and uh, I doing I was doing good uh, training camp because of I'm um, waiting, waiting some fight, and they f like finally give me fight. Yeah. We hear it's very challenging for you to get opponents. Um, does it surprise you that other opponents don't want to fight you? And what does that make you think of the division if, if they won't fight you? They make me think I'm the champion in this. I'm really, uh, they, they make me think. And then I'm going to gym. And uh, Habib or some, someone else smashed me. And they bring me back on the urge, you know. <laughs> And uh, I hope, I hope they, they will take these fights. They, they will approve it. someone t top five, maybe, after, after this fight. So you do get a fight. It's, it's a newcomer. Um, what do you think of your opponent? Have you had a chance to scout him? And, I mean, what did you think when that was the name they gave you as somebody that's new to the UFC? For me, it's have to uh, like being uh, active. For me, it's uh, I didn't uh, think it's fight. It's gonna be very easy fight for me, and I didn't train. No, I'm trained. I'm trained very hard. I'm trained like I'm, I will train for for the title. Like uh, I'm not sleep. And for my op opponent, it's opportunity, big opportunity, and. Uh, I think he's doing very like great job too, and we'll see this Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. Is it challenging because I know you're trying to move up the ranks, but if you win, people say, "Oh, but the, the guy wasn't even in the UFC. He's not that good." So, is this a challenging situation for you to be in? You know, I don't care about what they're gonna think. I really don't care. They have their their life. I have my life, and I didn't doing nothing for. Somebody will like nice with me, and they will say, "Yeah, this guy like very good." I don't care. I have family about have to I take care, and I have like my way, and I will doing like what I want. You're a respectful guy, but. Um, you win this fight. Do you have to start calling people by name to say, like, you know, why won't you fight me? Number one, you got to fight me. Number two, I mean, do you have to start doing that? You think it's going to be work? I don't know. They just talking about he don't deserve, he not beat nobody. How I didn't beat nobody? 4-0, it's not bad. How many fighters become beginning like this? Less guys. And... I don't want to be cocky. I'm not going to say, hey, I'm very, like, top for high level or nothing, like something like that, and I will some, somebody, like, knock him out or... No. I talk about, okay, if somebody come to UFC and he showing a good performance and uh, he, 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 he smash all his opponents, it means this guy have to fight with somebody, like, strong. And you can't just say, hey, he didn't deserve, like... He have to like show some, he have to beat somebody. Okay, how I'm gonna beat somebody? For example, Mirab talk about this. Mirab, how I'm gonna beat somebody if they not approve it? Yep, don't get the chance. So last thing for me then, knowing that, 
what's your goal here? Is it, is it just win and keep moving forward, or do you feel like you have to do something spectacular so people say that, hey, that guy has to fight the top of the division? No, no, I don't care about people. I don't care, care about what they're going to think about me. I'm trying to be a good person. I'm trying to be a good, good family, family guy, like good friend and good student. And uh, I just want to go to inside cage, take victory, and go home for enjoy. Hey, Umar. I just want your thoughts on uh, next week's title fight. Who do you think wins, uh, Sean O'Malley or Cheeto Vera? I think Sean O'Malley gonna is Sean O'Malley gonna smash this guy because he's their last fight. Cheeto win because of he O'Malley take like uh, he injured. That's why we didn't know what's gonna happening in this fight if he not injured, because until he injured, O'Malley go O'Malley was smashed in. And then, uh, what did you think of Marab's performance over Henry Cejudo? Very nice, like um, great performance, and it's not, you know, prime. When Cejudo was in his prime, I think he will never, he, he will never can beat uh, Mirab like Cejudo. And but we don't, we will not know. Like it's we we can't like we can't check this, and. He he did good job. He pushed it like he he go ahead, 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 and take nice victory. Just I can just congrats him. Awesome. Thank you.